Ah, uh, Pokemon. What can you say about Pokemon? Other than it's an evil plot by big business to siphon all your money into their pockets, why do they make two games each generation, huh? Huh? You don't need two! You only need one! Uh, I mean, Pokemon is great. If you were a 90s kid, then you're sure to have played with or seen it at some point in your life. It was a great concept. Catching evil or cute looking monsters and tiny balls and forcing them to fight one another? What could be better? Well, not only were the games, animes, toys, cards, blankets, dinnerware, cars, and furniture popular, but the music from the games and anime were as well. And I'm here to list my top 10. Ah, uh, who doesn't love this song? When you think Pokemon, it is one of the first songs you think of. Screw that, it is the first song you think of. Why? Because it is what you hear from most of the game. Exit a building, get on a bike. Enter building, exit building, get on bike. Rinse and repeat. In the older games, I always wished there was a button that would just automatically put you on your bike so you don't have to do that every time. I put this song so low on the list because, well, as good as it is, hearing it for hours and hours on end starts to grind your brain, and I would eventually mute my Game Boy after a while. So, you've just had a long hard day of battling with your Pokemon. They are exhausted, they need rest, so you take them to the Pokemon Center, where you are greeted with this calm tune as that machine makes your Pokemon all better again. I always wondered how that machine worked. Why don't they have one for humans? Are they using gamma rays or something on the Pokeballs to heal your Pokemon? What's going on in there? Put yourself in this position. You're eight years old. You just got cable because your parents aren't as poor anymore. You turn on the TV and you hear this. Holy crap. The first time I saw Pokemon, the theme song blew me away. And then the show came on and it cost me hundreds of dollars since. What can you say about Pokemon Season 1 theme song other than epic? So, you just received your first Pokemon from Professor Oak. You're ready to start your adventure with Squirtle, or Charmander, or Bulba- <laughs> Wait, nobody chose Bulbasaur. Or Pikachu if you had yellow. Anyway, finally, after 10 years of being a kid, it is time to head off into the world, battling dangerous looking monsters and brainwashing them to do your bidding. So, you head off into Route 1 and hear this amazing tune. So, you're just walking around in Pokemon. Ugh. As I was saying, you're just walking around with- Ah, stop that! So anyway, you're just walking around- Ah! Number six is trainer battle, enjoy! I have a question for you. Did you go to see Pokemon the first movie in theaters? If you said yes, did your mother or another relative take you, and did they fall asleep during it? Well, if so, then they missed this great song. Brother, my brother, tell me what are we fighting for? This song plays during the saddest and most powerful scene in the whole movie. If you didn't cry when you saw this the first time, then you have no soul. I will never forget this song, and every time somebody says, Pokemon the first movie, it is the first thing I think of. 
You've done it. You have defeated Lance, the leader of the Elite Four. You crushed his 30 million Dragon types and unlimited full restores, and have taken him down, thus becoming the Grand Champion. Wait a minute. That's right. Your rival, who many of you named Assface, beat you to it. The first time you saw this, you were probably filled with rage. You defeated Lance, you deserve to be champion, not Assface, who you've defeated on every occasion. It's time to take him down. Then you win and Professor Oak comes out of nowhere. <laughs> Pokemon 2000 is the only other Pokemon movie I went to see in theaters. I think it was the last one they showed in theaters, but I'm not sure. The movie was pretty forgettable to me anyway, there's not much I remember about it, except for one thing. Lugia's theme song. It's just pure awesome. It is so extremely calming and sounds perfect. Yeah, I can't think of anything else to say about it, so just enjoy it. Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness is a game I think was very underrated. Sure, it doesn't act like other Pokemon games, but it's still really fun catching other people's shadow Pokemon. You can just feel their pain. Every time I ran into this guy, Mir B, I would become giddy with excitement, put my controller on the ground and listen to his grooving theme for 10 minutes or so. Not to mention, look at that awesome fro. You've done it. You have defeated Lance, the leader of the Elite Four. You wait, wait, wait. That's not right. B back up. Ah, uh, that's better. You have just defeated the first three members of the Elite Four, and now you have to face your final challenge. The guy you've been hearing about all game. Lance the Dragon Master. The music you hear while you battle him lives up to all the hype he's been getting. This fight is nothing less than epic. And then you beat him, and you are the champion. Haha, <laughs> just kidding, go beat Assface. And that is my list of the top 10 music in Pokemon. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you didn't, well then you know what? That's fine, everyone has their own opinion. And I would love to hear yours. Leave a comment on your own top 10 Pokemon songs.